Okay, so quick update. Uh, today didn't go as planned. Um, so for privacy and safety re reasons, we kept my camera at home. So, but for today, what I did was I went to housing and got that over with. The good thing is, is that I don't have to move right away. Um, rent's good. Everything's good. I got everything taken care of for housing. So everything is good. Um, I did go food shopping a little bit. Again, I didn't bring stuff because I wanted to make sure, you know, privacy reasons, all that, and to be safe. So I went shopping. I went to go get Jason stuff, uh, his cigarette stuff. And then I came home. Um, we're going to be doing some uh, cleaning the bathroom. Uh, we're going to be doing some cleaning and some cooking today. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to be doing that. Um, may play a game depending on... Um, depending on the time um we're gonna be making some steak tonight uh with potato salad i may do a vegetable and some biscuits i'm not sure yet <laughs> i can't tell if i'm going bald or if my or if i'm just Recording right now? Yeah, yeah a little bit. <laughs> that was kind of funny. Yeah, good entrance line. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so that's what we've got planned for today. And um, so, hooray, we don't have to move. <laughs> Yay! For <laughs> y'all! <laughs> but yeah, rent is going to be the same. I don't have to worry about my rent. I called my caseworker. I still gotta call my mom. But that's all we're doing for right now. We may work on my budget. I may or may not still keep the camera rolling. <laughs> it depends. But yeah, that's what we've been doing today. I may do the library on Monday. Because I want to make Huh? No. I wanted, I wanted to make sure that we had plenty of time to do cleaning, putting food away, and uh, to uh, look up some stuff that I need to look up for Heidi. But yeah, we called her when we got back home, when we got out of the housing, we called her to let her know. And I do got paperwork to uh, give to her so she knows what's going on. Do I have anything to sign? Not that I know of. <coughs> I hate paperwork. That's all, folks. I am going to make myself a snack, though. And we'll be back, folks. I'm making myself a snack. <laughs> take it with you. Yeah, I can take it with me. <laughs> ah! I may have a couple taquitos. I know. Did you want to do cinnamon buns this weekend? Um, I got a couple of cinnamon buns. Oh, You're happy you got your milk? Yeah. I finally got his milk and he's all happy.
about to do my home routine. <laughs> So that I couldn't have two bathrooms because that way um, we can have our own bathroom. I wish I could have my own bathroom. Have our own levels in the house. This place has three floors, four or five bedrooms. The whole place. Uh, two bedrooms on each floor. Bathroom on each floor. She can have her own floor. I can have my own floor. Uh, that would be interesting. Uh, I got myself some cottage kind of cheese. Mm -hmm. And this place has an elevator. In the yes. House. Uh huh. It's New York. <laughs> Probably about there, yeah. Uh, if I was to live there, with my knees as bad as there, I'd walk the elevator. Great. They would look there still having fun. Mm -hmm. So they would look there still having fun. Alright, so... <laughs> My Reborns are over here, as you can see. Chloe, Sabrina, and Colin. They've just been hanging out with Mr. Jason today. No, they haven't. <laughs> and he's been taking good care of no, them. No, I haven't. <laughs> He's I wanted to do to those dolls and I decided not to. <laughs> so yeah, things whoops. <laughs> so things have been going good. Things have been going somewhat as planned. I've learned a lot of new information that I didn't know I was gonna have. So it is all good now. And I am very happy about it. Right? Because I remember at the beginning of this video, I was stressing about moving out, but finding out that we don't have to move. I'm so happy we don't have to. <laughs> Let's see, so. I just told Wednesday that we might be moving out. Now I gotta tell them we're not moving out. Yeah. Right, so. I'm gonna confuse the shit out of them. Poor guy. <laughs> All right, so seven. Is your camera still on, or can I turn this back up? It's still on. Okay. I can turn it off for now if you want. Mm -hmm. So right now I'm working on my budgeting. <laughs> so two eighty one. Not two eighty one. Thank you for getting my cigarette stuff. Yep. Oh yes, and I went and got Jason's uh, cigarette stuff today. You already said that. Yes. Two oh one. Right. What'd you do? Just hand him the note. Yep. Eighty one. Yep. Pretty much. <laughs> right. So. Good thing I wrote it out good enough to be able to read. <laughs> And you already paid the extra rent that they wanted you to, to cover. Mm -hmm. Write down forty for meds. And then. Minus 40, and then, okay, so that brings you to 
Okay. Two. That's groceries. Right. Uh, so minus the 280 brings you to 122.8. <laughs> and that's the big chunk that you can try to save as much as possible on every month. So even with the full 280 on food, you still have $122.80 for spending money and random stuff, and whatever's left over gets put in your savings. The 280, whatever is left at the end of the month, uh, also gets put in your savings, especially since, uh, what did you say your food stamps were this month? You got 226. And then, and then 290 in a couple days. So that is. 516. Mm -hmm. um, which, right off the bat, is like $128 a week. Which I spent like 76, something like that. Well, let me look at the receipt. From today? Uh -huh. It was 70 something today. Mm -hmm. Did you get the receipt? That looks like from the other day. Yeah. Alright, this was from today. And how much was it? I think 76 72. 7672 So okay so until until uh you know for the next full month the next 4 weeks you have 439 mm -hmm. and 28 cents mm -hmm. which is sitting pretty um, so even still, that's like $110 mm. for a budget each each week just off of your food stamps, which is great. Um, and I guess if you wanted to keep extra food stamp money to carry over into the next month, we were just that's when uh, that's when we would use the 280 that's supposed to be for groceries yeah. uh, for it. So if you wanted to have like a hundred dollars carry over for food stamps not that it like really matters since you kind of want to be spending only your food stamps on food each month um but you know even still for the next four weeks you could do 110 for your food stamps and then an extra 20 bucks out of your food budget yeah um which would save you 200 dollars out of the 280 Plus the 122 is 322 put right in your savings. <clears throat> of course, next month it'll be you'll you won't have uh, the 500 in food stamps, but you know just having that extra cash right off the bat would be really nice. So maybe you should just worry about uh, only spending the food stamps on food this month. Mm -hmm. But you know, yeah. Now that rent is not going up, you are sitting really good, and we're back on track with what we were working on a few weeks ago. Yeah, that kind of makes me feel a little better. Yeah. The camera's still on? A little bit. <laughs> so, a little bit. So, for the camera, uh, after doing her whole budget, after we thought rent was raising, she was something like minus $8 a month, <laughs> which, not that that's exactly what she would be uh, stuck with, because you'd be able to save money on your food and, and, and whatnot week to week, 
but that's still barely saving anything, best case scenario. Now that rent is not being uh, increased, you're pretty much guaranteed to be saving at least 100 a month. Which is That's great. what I want to work on too. Is yeah, saving at least a hundred dollars a yeah. month. Yeah. So like, if you're if we're gonna take that into account, um, you know, minus the hundred that you want to be saving, that leaves you with twenty two dollars and eighty cents of spending money. Which obviously the spending money goes up if you don't spend a lot of your food money. Um, and twenty twenty three bucks will cover random crap, trash bags, uh, laundry detergent, toilet paper, whatever you know, dish soap, whatever. Um, and then you know, since that would be during a grocery trip anyway, that would uh, be worked into the weekly food budget. Is those kinds of things. So. At least twenty two eighty in spending money, usually more. Pretty much guaranteed a hundred dollars saved every month. Almost definitely more, month to month. Um, and you know, yeah, so it's looking pretty good. And you're learning how to, you know, if, if you want takeout one night and you're like, okay, let's go to Little Caesars and spend 20 bucks or 25 bucks, then just subtract that from next week's food budget, uh, shopping budget, because that's paying for a dinner anyway, which is what the 20 bucks would have gone toward in grocery shopping, 20 bucks for ingredients. Yeah, I was telling Heidi about that whole th the, the uh, Valentine's Day thing, and I, I wanted to order out, but Jason said something about um, <laughs> eating in, and uh, I actually <laughs> felt his forehead. And checking for a fever to make sure he's all right. What did she say to that? <laughs> She actually chuckled and she's like, what do you mean? And I said, well, normally he'd be jumping all over it, but I think he's trying to be supportive. So that's the reason why he was trying to come up with a compromise on cooking. Yeah, and see how quick both of you have already adjusted to cutting back on certain things. Like he was actually excited to make garlic bread pizza because it's a fun idea and it turned out great. That's another thing we should do. Um, Make garlic bread pizza for one of our videos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> By the way, once I start taking that new shot, <clears throat> my appetite's gonna be like cut in half. So, yeah, the um, budget's gonna be a little bit better. Yeah. <laughs> yes, people. So we're get, we're gonna be doing some cooking videos sometime this week. Sky, Sky may be on. <laughs> A little pupper. My little pup. Oh, yep. Yep. I do kid videos and I have my um, my little Anna, stuffed animals do some mm -hmm. stuff. <laughs> yes, but daddy has to do the voice on some yes. for <laughs> Last night we were, we were bored, right? I want to do so it my laundry. Jamie, Jamie pulls out the Muppet Julie, right? Mm hmm. And, um, you know, I'm the comedian, so I made Julie, you know, because she, she says she's got swamp ass, you know, swamp ass, yep. right, is right, okay, yep. well, she goes up and back and checks, and she's trying to get everybody to smell her fingers. <laughs> she's disgusting. <laughs> I was bored. I come up with this shit, like, on the fly. Yeah, just... It's improv. It's good for the brain. Exactly. Yeah, good for just keeping yourself sharp. <laughs> but my improv can get really nasty. Really raunchy. Oops. All right, guys, I'm back and I'm doing laundry. <laughs> Last week I was freaking the Muppet out because I was telling her how Junior was made. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I got a pipe stuck up his butt. Oh, God. Yes. <laughs> So now I'm doing laundry, which I really hate laundry. <laughs> Sometimes uh, Sue and I will sit here and do laundry. <laughs> I'm not really thrilled with laundry. I we used I used to have this um, staff person um, named Jen. And she used to uh, love laundry. She was obsessed with it. Boy. 
Why? I don't she know. loved folding laundry. Who loves folding laundry? I don't know. Every time I did laundry, I'm like, every time I hate everybody, it. Leave my unmentionables alone. Uh -uh. <laughs> Only Jamie's allowed to touch those. So yeah, today I'm doing laundry, and then we're gonna be doing some cleaning. We got our new budget set up, pretty nice looking. Yeah, got a new budget set up for this month at least. It's kind of looking like you'll save upwards of yeah. You know, if if, if you don't need to dip into your ca or even if you dipped eighty dollars into your cash, giving you a, a budget of one hundred and thirty a week you would still be saving $200 on your food on top of the $100 that you're trying to guarantee to save. So like if I did like 130 for spending money, I would still have a little bit left for... Yeah. And I've been talking us out of going... Surprisingly, I've been talking us out of going out, uh, ordering out. Yeah. She's freaking out because I'm doing that. <laughs> Normally, he'd be all over it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, you set the goal in your head, and you just are slowly and, adjusting and getting more comfortable well, with that. Well, and talking to my caseworker, she, um... As nutty as a fruitcake. <laughs> she said she doesn't mind if we order out once in a while. It depends on what it is, how much it is. Just don't go over And more. if we do it, yeah. like, maybe once a month, not uh, every other, like, let's say we order out this month. Maybe skip next month and then order out again or, or something like that. Maybe skipping months. Uh, um, but depending on how much things are. Uh, she thought it was a good idea when we uh, made McDonald's at home. Yeah, definitely. And it's very easy to make McDonald's at home. <laughs> so, Mine was definitely better. I may put that in a cooking video too just to let you guys know. Look, honey, the Ebola virus. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, but yes, I may get into my cooking videos again. I may get into all of my other videos again. Like I said, I've been going through anxiety and depression, so I'm sorry I haven't put anything out. Uh, but now that I know we're not moving and everything is copacetic, uh, <laughs> yeah, a big word, copacetic. Um, so, uh, what the, that's a 50 cent word right there. Right? <laughs> so, everything is good now. Uh, like I said, uh, I'll let you guys know about my uh, what's going on with my business. Uh, and um, I'll let you guys know what's going on. Um, to let you guys know, um, I'm not getting the toddlers right away. Because of uh, my whole budget thing, I February and March, well, this month and March, I was supposed to be getting some toddlers, but because of my budget right now, excuse me, I cannot afford to get any more reborns right now. <laughs> I got to start saving some money. So Yeah, and if, if you get your money on the 10th, if on the 9th you realize, like, I haven't spent any of my spending money for the month, then, you know, don't feel bad about spending just a little bit because you're still going to be saving a lot of it. Right. Especially if your food uh, has been, you know, your shopping trips have been sticking to budget and you're feeling confident. Um, you know, obviously everyone wants to be saving as much as possible, but if by the 9th you see, like, oh, damn, I have uh, 200 plus dollars left, you know, 190 is still a really good amount saved, and spending 10 on on a thing to make you, you know, a little bit of a treat for yourself, I guess, at the end of the month for, for being so far ahead. Right. Well, what I want to do is, like, not only just save money for the home ownership po program, I want to also be um, <clears throat> saving money for my business. Um, saving money so that we could actually get a house um, and I also want to save money so that Jason and I can take a little mini vacation or something like going yeah. to a hotel or doing something for ourselves getting out and uh, 
doing some things like that because we haven't been able to do that because like I said we haven't been able to save money so but yeah with this new budget a few months from now you're gonna see that you have and, I, and again you know, I've been helping yeah you know it's a group effort here and a few months from now you, you might realize like oh I've got you know I don't know six hundred seven hundred dollars saved you know let's treat ourselves a little bit Let's go to Disney. Yeah, maybe not that much of a treat, but I want to go to the Disney park that has all the Star Wars stuff. Uh, I think that one's the one in California. I don't, I don't actually know. I think the only thing we've been really keeping up on is trash, laundry, dishes, and dishes. I've been sick. <laughs> I think everything else I've been kind of lacking on. Those are three really important things to keep up with, though. Yeah, I, I've been and sick, so, you know. So, I'm going to... I gonna, have a reason. <laughs> and so, when we're doing uh, my new goals, my new goals will be um, keeping the kitchen clean, uh, living room clean, bathroom clean, bedroom clean, <clears throat> working on the laundry closet, maybe working some on some organizing some other closets, but... Uh, the three rooms or four rooms that need to be clean is bathroom, bedroom, laundry, living room, and kitchen. And maybe help with some of the things I can't do. But other than that, I think we've been doing pretty well. But yes, I can do the toilet if you want to help me with the rest of the bathroom. Yep, yep that was our deal. Yes. She does the toilet, I'll help with all the rest of it. <laughs> I can understand why no one wants to do the toilet. It's kind of icky, but... It's all Jamie's fault. How is it my fault? Because <laughs> it is. <laughs> I don't use the toilet. I'll go, I go find a fire hydrant to squat by. He doesn't really. <laughs> but, yeah. I could. <laughs> but yes, I do plan on doing some videos in the park, doing some craft stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Just gotta remember to leave the husband home with his phone. Yes. Trying to do a video in the park. <laughs> oh, yes. Here, here. Tweet, 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 tweet. Um. He was playing on his phone when I was trying to do, like, a video. I want to do that popsicle stick video again because apparently I'm talking and... I realized when I was talking, all of my stuff was down here and... I realized I wasn't even showing what I was making. <laughs> and then I'm like, hmm. It happens. But, yeah. <laughs> so this goes in the bathroom. I'm in the bedroom. One of those shirts I think was mine. in Chinatown. If they suck, leave a funny comment that makes me laugh. Do it. <laughs> I like this guy. Yeah. Your pile is on your bed. Okay, okay. <clears throat> so yeah, but... But where I am running low on battery, I'll, ex I'll talk to you guys and let you guys know what we're doing later. And I may put some more on. Alright, talk to you later. Bye. <laughs>